Hello, this is Justin with Reborn Entertainment, and I'm bringing you tutorial number two for Reborn Crosswords. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create your own crossword puzzles. So I am at the main menu. I'm going to click Create Your Own. Change this to Tutorial 2. Now here you can set the dimensions of your crossword puzzle. The max is 99 by 99, and if you do that, the uh, if you if you hit the max, the boxes are going to be micro, but it's up to you. The default size is 15 by 15, and this is what it should be, to the max at least, for mobile devices. Uh, anything larger than that is going to be really hard to read on a small little uh, phone. You can also import uh, crossword puzzles from from other crossword puzzle engines. Um, if I click on that, you can click on the question mark to get more information about that. But for this tutorial, I'm going to start from scratch. So I'm going to go back and then click on Create New Board. This creates a 15 by 15 grid. And you can just start filling out the letters. So let's say. <clears throat> So I'm just clicking in each square and using my keyboard to type. <clears throat> if you're on a mobile device, uh, you'll have a keyboard at the bottom here you can use instead. So here is my crossword puzzle so far. Um, you can put in information about yourself or your company here. And that will show up when someone's playing a crossword puzzle if they hit info. You can also shift things, shift the whole board to the left or the right if you find that you're not having enough room. And you can also change the size of your board here um, <clears throat> if you want to make it smaller or larger. And you can change the title here. You can also change the title up here. And you hit the Build button. It's going to take all the words that are in your crossword puzzle <clears throat> and list them out here for you. And you can add your own definitions. So, say to take down in a boat. Post fun. I don't know. I'm going to hit submit when I'm all done. It gives you the opportunity to share this puzzle. You can either um, send this using an email. People can click on that link and it will send you them to your puzzle. Or you can embed it in your own website. If you go to this link here, it shows you more information on embedding, how you can change colors, and all sorts of options. You can also share it on Facebook or share it on Twitter. I close that menu down and you'll see my crossword puzzle here and my definitions that go with it. And that's it. It's all saved and ready to be played.